so far this is what I have I've glued some of the 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 paper the music paper on this and now when I'm ready okay let's see let me cut out some of these stringy things that I just don't like all of that that's too much but um then I'll go ahead and I'll I'll kind of just put it here just to see how it looks I'm gonna put some of the burlap coming out of it I'm gonna try to put some of the burlap coming out of it okay it's just to make it look a little bit more natural more rustic like so and you kind of just stick it over the hole like so okay like this great I think it's gonna work out okay so I'm gonna go ahead this is so far I'm sorry but the lighting is not that good um just like that I'm gonna go ahead and glue it that way um, and I'm gonna go ahead and show you how I glue it it's fairly easy again I use my Mod Podge and I mean my uh, Fabri-Tac glue and I'll just glue like so okay I don't know if you could see that I'll just glue the edges of the of the box okay because mind you the, the box the edge edges are not going to show on the other side okay they're just not going to show and if you're having a hard time just glue it on the actual canvas like that just put the glue on the actual canvas okay and then just go ahead and press it in make sure you have the table because you don't want to press it so hard that that you you just make a bigger hole just make sure it's on a flat surface and just press your box in there like so now mind you I'm kind of letting it dry a little bit and what I did was then I go ahead and I use my um, my Fabri-Tac glue again and try to glue this th this edging or what have you the fabric like so I don't know if I'm gonna like my paper let me go ahead and undo this see how I go ahead and play with it and very easily I can just pull out and uh, change my mind and I could go back and forth that's why I don't like doing tutorials too much because I'm not very consistent in this sense I could be telling you to do this and then I change it um, okay let me see I'm gonna go ahead and glue this one in like this now mind you this this burlap it's gonna be closed I mean it's not it's not gonna be all out there you know you're just gonna see little pieces of it okay you're gonna see little pieces of it um, oops okay and like so because as you, if you have seen my other work you know other works in the in the past all other creations that I've done I use a lot of flowers um, and I have a tendency of sometimes um, just covering it all up okay so it, it it's it's kind of cool because even if you make a mistake it, you're not gonna see it you're you know and and that's why I like my Fabri-Tac glue Fabri-Tac glue to me it glues almost everything okay it even glues metal as long as it's not heavy because if it's too heavy it's just not going to um, hold it up you know it just doesn't have the strength but but it does glue basically almost everything okay so now I went ahead and I took these off the ones I had glued first I took them off and I'm gonna go ahead and glue them again but I'm gonna glue it to the top of the burlap like so I think it's gonna be better okay that's what I'm, I'm gluing it like that I might add some more I don't know because that's as as I go along I'll go ahead and start adding and and moving things around okay so um, like so and then I got this little piece that I just pulled out 
So I'm going to go ahead and put this. Now mind you, my hand is in the way and I'm not good at, at doing these tutorials. So just bear with me, I'm doing the best I can here. Okay, so there is, there is the box with the image I'm going to use, okay, and some burlap, okay. Then I'm going to go ahead and get my images. First I have to find it in this mess, mind you. Um, I do make a mess. That, that I do admit. And I'm going to go ahead and add it to here. I'm going to add this image to this like that. Um, this says something good will happen today. I don't, I'm going to go ahead and ink it a little bit so you don't see the white of the, the edge of the fuzzy cutting. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, just ink it. I do make a mess, mind you. I do, I do make a mess in when I do, you know, when I'm scrapbooking and doing a. But I'm not this quite messy. It's just that because I'm doing this and doing a tutorial on it, I don't, you know, I'm trying to do it as quickly as I can. Okay, um, like so. So, and I was going to emboss it, but I've changed my mind. I'm not going to emboss the image just because I don't want it really glitzy. I don't want it. I want it more rustic looking. So now what I do is I'm going to go ahead and just glue this on the canvas. Okay. I'm going to glue this on the canvas and like so. I'm going to lift up some of this burlap because I want the burlap to overlap my image like so. Okay. So, so far this is what I got. Okay. So far this is what I have. Um, like so. Okay. I have this but this is kind of too I don't know if it's going to work because it's almost like glittery looking and I don't know if it's going to look good with this um, with these tones and this type of paper. Um, it's not the same collection so it's kind of hard to make it work. I'm going to go ahead and see if I can See, I don't like that. Okay, so anyway, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to start looking for my flowers. Okay, I'm going to start looking for my flowers and, and come back on the next video. Okay, bye-bye.